Project. I'm going to be talking about Miss Beasley. She is a math teacher at the high school and the reason I picked Miss Be Beasley is because she helped me learn math the way that no other teacher ever has and she was always there for me even with personal problems and she was always there for me to talk to and she teaches kids like a way to learn math that no other teacher has ever done and she just explains everything well and I'm just grateful for her because I know kids struggle with math all the time including myself. Thank you. One teacher I'm grateful for and admire is my AP statistics teacher Miss Garut. Something I admire about her is her confidence in her teaching. Before I enrolled in AP stat I was pretty hesitant because it seemed really difficult and I didn't know if I could do it but she assured me that she could teach me the material and get me to understand it. And she absolutely did. And I feel very confident going into my AP test in May. Also, she has always been so helpful when I have a million questions to ask. And being in her class has shown me that I can accomplish anything I set my mind to. So to Miss Garut, thank you so much for everything. Hi, I just wanted to take a minute to appreciate the fact that Coach Garrison you taught me how to be determined every day to smile. Now, every day in class you had a joke or you smiled about anything and it showed me that you were determined to smile every day and it made me feel a little bit better and it taught me some things and I want to appreciate that. Thank you, Mr. Garrison. I am thankful for Ms. Hatfield. This spring semester of my senior year, I've had the opportunity to have her twice in a day in the morning for pre-AP chemistry and in the afternoon for peer tutor. Ms. Hatfield is very passionate about her job and cares about her students as if they were her own. And every morning I am excited to learn about chemistry, which I honestly never thought would be possible. She is also extremely sweet. When I go to grade stuff, she'll put a note of encouragement for me, which I appreciate. Thank you, Ms. Hatfield. Thank you to Ms. Hoover, my home ec teacher at Claremont High School. She has helped me with a lot through these last few years. She is, a, she is the teacher that does SCCLA and I have been in there since I started going to Claremont High School. She has helped me become more outgoing and I had me go over my fear of speaking in front of people. I have been in more, I have been in more club related things since I have met her. She really gets me out there and I really appreciate that. One teacher I'm grateful for is Mr. Eisenbart, my seventh and eighth grade tech ed teacher, and more importantly, my uh, TSA advisor. Thank you, Mr. Eisenbart, for always being there for me. Even when I'm failing, you help me get through things and get past it and get to the level I need to be at to be a national champion. And thank you for always staying after school and helping me and several other students get uh, our projects done and practice our chapter team and other events. Hi, my name is Haley Braswell. I'm a senior at Claremore High School and I choose Coach Jan as my teacher. I never had him as a teacher, but I did have him as my soccer coach for four years. Coach Jan always encouraged me and pushed me to be a better person and a better soccer player. Off the field, he would always be there for me if I needed to talk or if I needed help with extra homework. He always knows how to, how to say the right thing, and he would always say hi to me in the halls. And I couldn't have asked for a better soccer coach for the last four years. Once again, thank you, Coach Jan. I would like to thank Ms. Claver, my English board teacher this year. She was the type of teacher that builds her students up, meaning she helps her students out if they are having issues on an assignment or if they are having 
personal issues or like family issues, she would help as much as possible, as much as she could in the classroom. And she was just the type of teacher that I aspire to be. So thank you, Ms. Claver, for everything you've done for me this year. Thank you, Ms. Little, for always having a kind heart, being patient, and teaching us to your best of your abilities. Thank you, Coach Nolan, my ninth grade history teacher at Claremore High School, for setting a high expectation for all. Even though teachers may set a high standard for all students, they set those standards to be challenging and realistic for our future. This means that even though they set us up for high standards, we can set each student up for those high standards to be met by striving to help each student with whatever they need. Thank you, Mr. Nolan, for being an outstanding AP or a teacher. He's always available if we need help on our work or just want to talk. And we can always joke with him in class and get back on topic easily. This makes the material easier to remember and makes the class more enjoyable. A teacher that I am very grateful for is Mr. Pike. I am grateful for him because of how he runs his class and how he is always there for his students. He isn't a pushover and he keeps us in check, which I appreciate. Other drama teachers I've had haven't been the best at that. But at the same time, he jokes around with us and likes to make us laugh. He is also always there when you need someone to talk to, and he's very approachable. I just want to say thank you to Mr. Pike for furthering my knowledge of theater and just being an all-around great teacher. One teacher that I am extremely thankful for is Mrs. Schrock. She's always helpful and devoted into helping me and my fellow classmates to get through her class. She was always nice to us and was always kind, for whenever we walked through her door, she was always saying good morning. We were always having a good time in her class and we learned so many new things. I am so appreciative of Mrs. Schrock for helping me to get through her class and have a good time with it. She's so sweet to us and I thank her so much for everything she's done to us. Thank you. Hi, I'm Vanessa, and I just wanted to say thank you to my Algebra 2 teacher, Miss Smith. She has helped us through a lot, especially with this whole distance learning. She's walked us through it. She's let us, like, email her or Zoom calls, and um, just, like, she's been patient with us because this whole distance learning is kind of hard. It's like, um, I don't know, she's just been helping us a lot through that, and... I know it's her first year of teaching and she's been doing really good for her first year of teaching and I'm really proud of her and I just want to say thank you for helping us. Thank you to Ms. Travis, the student council advisor at Claremore High School. You've always shown such strong patience towards me and the other kids in the class, especially on the really hard days when we're super stressed out with paperwork or deposits and stuff like that. You've always just been such a rock for us. And thank you so much for encouraging all of us to pursue our passion for leadership and just continuing to help us grow. Hi, I'm Chloe Zigafoos, and a teacher that I'm very grateful for at CHS would be Coach Weens. I've had the privilege of not only having Coach Weens as my ZAP advisor for all four years of high school, but also as a track and cross country coach. Coach Weens has such a big and bright personality and is always ready to greet you with a high five and a smile, no matter the day of the week. As a teacher, since the moment I met him, he was so engaging and encouraging me to join track since freshman year. I grudgingly decided to my junior year and as a coach he genuinely cared to see me succeed even being a newbie and zap he cares very deeply about his students futures and wants them to succeed in the highest and helps them kind of figure out what's best for them coach weens you're definitely going to be invited to my wedding one day and i just want to say thank you for being so great